So when's the last time you played Sonic Runners? It's a good question because I can't remember. <laughs> Mine was two days ago because I was like, thinking to myself, it's been a while since I played it, and but I haven't really touched it since the 2.0 update. Let's see, let's let's have a good go at it. And plus, they patched it several fucking times. Is it still as still as good? Is it anything different? No, it's even more shitter than I, when I fucking reported on it. Mm. I swear it has gotten worse and worse with every update. I mean, when I did the three reasons I listed, it's a gambling machine, it requires a DRM, mm. and uh, I can't remember the third reason now. The way the red, the way they reward you or something? Uh, I, can't, I can't remember now, but everything major about the game hasn't been addressed. Mm. You still have to gamble all your red rings away, or even buy more red rings, just to unlock specific characters. Mm. And even then, it is random. The newest character I got on when I actually thought, you know what, I'll use I'm the act I thought I'll use red rings, here we go. I got Espio. Great, I got Espio, I got another speed character. And on top well you still I also random though. I wanted to get Blaze. I didn't get Blaze, I didn't get choose, choose to get Blaze. Could be here's a character ticket, choose your character. There there we go, I can choose my one character I need, level them up, and so I can get a good team. Okay, the 2.0 updates, what have they done? First of all, instead of, they've got episodes, but also got like a time trial challenge thing. Mm-hmm. Which you had to collect time, get fat, much points you can go. Yada yada. Yeah. Cleared it once, wasn't really interested in it. Episodes, still the same. You can now have multiple groups, so you can have to five different pairs mm. of characters. So you have two, two speed, two fly, two power, or speed fly. So you can, choose, two, you can pick what characters you want. You now have item, item, the item ruler and the premium ruler are now separate instead of actually switch between the two. Yeah. You get tickets for each one. You get a premium ticket or an item, or an item roulette ticket. So you'd have to spend your red rings or happen to go through at least 10 episodes to get 10 chow eggs. Uh, what else was updated? Um, nothing really. Yeah, well, the layouts. Oh. That's about me. Layouts, layouts, the, the, the hood. The GUI has changed a bit. Well, on top of that, all the other updates, as it's so-called, were practically nerfing every opportunity to have the game be fun. Like, they're, th- they're like really proud of giving you a level a level 7 Shara. Oh great, I already had a level 2 Shara, so now it's a, now it's a level 9 Shara. Which, my level 2 Shara at the time said, collect 250, 200, uh, no, 450 combo, Get, grant you a non-coloured item. Great, that was great. A level 9 Shara from the 2.0 update, 720 combo to activate a... Just, what the fuck happened? Seriously. What the fuck happened? It was fun. It wasn't great, but it was fun. Now, it's a game I don't want to fucking pick up. Mm. You will, you get, you get... I don't think it's like you updated it, I guess it's a double-edged sword here. When you're actually doing a normal run, you get a lot more score. You get rewarded a lot more for it. So, up to the third part of, of the speed up, I had over 2 million to 3 million score. That would take me at least 5, five Eggman battles to get there with some with some buffs. I get it within 3. And even when I get to the fifth part, I got nearly, seven, I got nearly 5 million. Hmm. And that was a fucking task on version one. <laughs> and when you get to the episode, and it has the bar telling you how far you go to face Eggman, one million score will get me most of the way there. I have to get another <laughs> half a million, one million, just to get to the Eggman. Yeah, for some reason, yeah, that's always the thing that always bothered me. Is in somehow the normal run, you you're supposed to be your score level goes up a bit, but somehow the boss level can raise it all the way through half the fucking time. Pretty much. The last the last um, segment between the checkpoint and Eggman, it was like maybe a million score you had to get, but fair enough. And the other million was basically just the first first five five or six checkpoints. Now five million score can barely get me through one fucking segment. I did three runs and I saw on the same fucking episode and I probably acquired at least twelve million score and I'm not done with the episode. Oh god. 
it is forcing you to stick with one episode of repeat runs just to get enough score to get to Eggman. Uh. What the fuck happened? Yeah. Oh, you can get the bus, use different characters, have... I don't fucking care. I can use different characters, I use the same three characters, Tails, Eggman, and Knuck Knuckles... Tails, Sonic, and Knuckles, all the time, and the previous... I'm up to episode 38, or 38B, I think. There's more than 50... There's, it says 50 episodes, but no, there's more, there's like 75 in total. Oh, God. And I went through the majority of that with version 1. Now I can barely get through one episode, and that's using several runs. Mm. It is Sonic Runners is no, no longer fun. It still requires a DRM. It still requires you to spend real money and gamble all your fucking red rings away. Mm. The score it gives you more score, but it's fucking worthless. All the char all the characters and I and buddies you always get have been nerfed to fuck. And the additional run of um the time travel thing is fucking pointless. The only reason they added into it is because, oh no, a lot of people who had it on the soft launch of version 1 have already completed the fucking game. No one's gonna play it anymore. You have ruined it. It is not fun. Boom 2, Sonic Dash 2, Sonic Boom is more fun. Because it has it has, the it has the challenges, it has the events, and it doesn't require you to you keep buying it. stuff. Yeah. It's like, sing one ninety nine and get a 24-hour boost of free revives, addition additional event tickets, and, a and more an additional an additional rare sprite. Fine, one ninety nine. Guess what? Well, it tells you to do it once. Mm. And you're not pressured by it. You can play the next day. Just stick to console games, Sonic Team, honestly. That's my review right now. Yeah. What about you? What about you? Because I pretty much said everything. Yeah. I mean, like you, like you said, I haven't played it for a bit, but every time I have played it, my biggest problem is I'll get to the group at one point when the game starts running smoothly. I'll get into a decent groove of it, and then the game will pretty much by the time I've finished a level or got a full one hour level, that's how it bloody works. Is every time he does the results spins, pretty much there and then the game will like they put another and then kick me out of the game or will kick me out of the game because it's gone. It decides to go. Yeah, fuck. It is, it's also still poorly optimized. You're still requiring a large amount of cash from the, from the iPad or ta or any tablet to actually run a fucking advert. Hmm. And even then, like you said, it will just crash. It will just boot you out to the to the fucking set setup screen. Yeah. And you go back in, and you still got everything, but you don't get the results. No, I mean, that's the thing. It's basically, you, you finished it, it's just basically now you just have to go through the whole fucking thing. And it's, that's the biggest problem, really, runners, is that it just... How does this somehow make it harder to work on any mobile devices than two 3D games, essentially, which are running games as well? A 3D running games? Yeah. Even the most... I can get... I can even get... Because I use a Nexus 7, which is a very dated tablet in today in today's technology i can still run more gravity intensive games hmm. i mean recent like, like I, can, I, I can run a first person shooter on that i don't i don't recommend playing for fps games on yeah. a tablet but i can run one smoothly yeah. i can run raymond adventures yeah smoothly. i was gonna say raymond adventures is recently coming out and basically if you were to say what would you like sonic runners to be well like raymond adventures you know you go in you play the game it doesn't completely butt fuck every time you try and finish a level all the adverts and everything it's a lot of things. yeah and guess what it, it has different missions it has only three different as always four different missions mm. to go through but it has different challenges with it yeah just get raymond adventures Anyone, just get Raymond Adventures. Yeah. That is a fucking great mobile game. Does it cost to get costumes? Yeah. yeah. You have to be great. online to play it, but it pretty much works once you're online. It's fun. Does it make any sense in the story? <laughs> nope. But then again, oh. Origins made yeah. no sense. That was just a bunch of that was a bunch of evil creatures pissed off because Raymond and his friends were snoring yeah, too loud. Well, well, they've been using that for the last two games. Why well, stop there? <laughs> yeah. And you choose between Rayman, Rayman, or Bowser yeah, if you want. The other characters are there as well, so you can get them. Yeah, you can also do characters. You can actually have Rayman looking at Vars from Far, Far Cry 3. <laughs> yeah, we did that. Oh god, they did that. I'm not so sure what Barbara's costume is. <laughs> they're, they're varied. Definitely varied. Honestly, between the two, you rather play an Ubisoft game or a Sonic Team game or well, a mobile? I think, 
playing playing well, Ubisoft so games because it fucking works. If you ask works. me, I think Sonic Team needs to go to Ubisoft or Michelle on sale last. Then do you mind if we could use your engine because we really need to fucking make this work? <laughs> I'll just leave it to Hardlight, yeah. okay? <laughs> Hardlight fucking works. <sighs> when I, when all fails, just give it to the British. <laughs> Give give them the, give them the nice <laughs> license. I want to see a nice I want to see a nice game on the mobile because honestly, with the oh even the three DS with the gyro, with the gyroscope or the accelerometer. Yeah. There you go. Again, we're not we're not trying to be mean about Sonic Team, but like we said, it's like look, you know how to make console games work now. Your mobile game, you have a lot to learn. If anything, just have hard light work on the, and then you just basically take care of the main stuff. Yeah, just stick the yeah. console, Sonic Team. We're we're being nice about this because a lot of people wouldn't be okay. <laughs> <laughs> 